Alrighty guys, what is going on? My name is Tubby Emu. Look at these beautiful mid-air finishers. Now I'm going to break them down and look at them all individually. But take a look and finally we get something new to the game. This is a great addition. The last time I remember us having something like this was Randy Orton in 2007, 2008, and maybe even 2009 uh, or was it 2010 where he had an RKO out of mid-air. Um, that's the last time I remember it. Here we're getting an actual addition now, I don't know if it's going to be like an All-Stars. The All-Star engine that even Backyard Gaming loves has it where you can do finishers out in midair. The animations look a little meh. I'm almost wondering if this is a special finisher where you have to put them up in the corner. Uh, but since the person was already top row bound, I don't exactly know how it'll work. I'm a little curious to see what the actions will be and what the animations will be like. I'm a little worried because in Predator Technology last year, when you went for moves and you're running, you often ran by the guy or the connection wasn't really there as it is in All-Stars where it more fluidly connects, as you see right here. It makes me think that this is more of um, uh, a preset animation versus you can do it on any time. That's my only concern with this. Other than this, I think it looks absolutely wonderful. As you guys can see, Chokeslam. Goes to gets up, makes it just like the WWE, and look at this. We get a new choke slam animation, or at least it may not be new, but it's a hell of a lot better than the one Kane does in WWE 12. Guys, I'm excited. If you're excited for these new animations, you want to stay tuned to more WWE 13 news, make sure to smash that like button. There's a link in the description, the top, wherever. If you want to pre-order your copy of Amazon of WWE 13 on Amazon, it's in the description. Tubby Emu out.